Honda's electric supercharged V3 motorcycle engine sound will blow your mind. You know that feeling when you hear something for the very first time, and it instantly sends a shiver down your spine? That's exactly what today's video is all about. Welcome to HSR Motors, the place where we don't just talk about cars and bikes, we bring you right into the heart of the action. And today, we've got something that will make every motorcycle enthusiast's pulse race. But before we rev into the story, I've got a challenge for you. If you love being first to hear groundbreaking sounds and see incredible engineering in action, I want you to smash that like button and help us hit our goal. 10,000 likes and 1,000 comments within the next 24 hours. It's a bold target, but our community has done it before, and I know we can do it again. And hey, if you haven't subscribed yet, seriously, what are you waiting for? One click on that subscribe button and the bell icon means you'll never miss a moment like this again. Now, quick little disclaimer before we start. All rights to video footage and sounds remain with their original creators and manufacturers. We're here purely to talk about it, break it down, and share our own perspective for education and entertainment. Here's my question for you today, and think carefully before answering. In Honda's new teaser, what is that sweet, high-pitched whine you can hear in the last 12 seconds? Is it just background noise? Or is it something way more exciting? Drop your guess down in the comments right now. No cheating by skipping to the end for the answer. All right, let's get into it. Honda has been slowly, deliberately, and masterfully building anticipation for its electrically supercharged V3 motorcycle engine concept since they first pulled back the curtain at EICMA 2024. It's been a long wait for more details, and now, finally, we've got something new. Not a full reveal. Not a boring technical lecture. But a teaser. And oh boy, it's a good one. Here's the thing about teasers. Most companies get them wrong. Either they don't give you enough to care, or they give away so much that the mystery is gone before the actual reveal. It's like watching a movie trailer that accidentally shows you the entire plot. You've seen it happen. But Honda. This time, they nailed the third and rarest approach, showing just enough to make you sit up, lean forward, and desperately want more. Now, I'm going to say something that might sound dramatic, but it's the truth. If you haven't already watched the teaser with headphones, you're not getting the full effect. So before you watch, Grab your best pair of headphones, turn the volume up, and give yourself 50 uninterrupted seconds. It's less than a minute of your life, but it will stick with you. What you'll see isn't some glossy CGI render, it's real footage. Small glimpses. Flashes of the V3 engine on a test bench. Just enough of the internals to make your mind race with possibilities. And here's where Honda gets really clever. In some shots, there are sensor blocks strategically placed over certain components. It's just enough to keep you guessing. Instead of frustration, it actually builds excitement, because if they're hiding it, you know it's something big. And then, we get to the reason you're here. The final 12 seconds. If you're a gearhead, if you live for mechanical music, you will instantly recognize what you're hearing. That's not just any sound, it's the intake whine of the electric supercharger, or as Honda calls it, the electric compressor. This isn't some add-on turbocharger retrofit. This is a fully integrated part of an entirely new V3 engine design. Why is that so exciting? Because electric supercharging opens up possibilities that traditional forced induction just can't match. Instant boost. No lag. More precise control over intake pressure. And for a motorcycle, where every split-second throttle response counts, that's game-changing. Think about it. Honda could have gone with a traditional turbo or mechanical supercharger, but by going electric, they're not just chasing raw power, they're chasing efficiency, responsiveness, and perhaps even emissions control in a way that fits into future regulations. This could be a sign that Honda's future performance bikes will blend the thrills of combustion with the precision of electrification in ways we haven't seen before. The whole teaser is a masterclass in restraint. You're left with more questions than answers, but in a good way. How much power are we talking about? What kind of motorcycle is this engine going into? Will it be a track weapon, a street fighter, a sport tourer, or something entirely new? And what's that torque curve going to look like with an electric supercharger at play? Personally, I think this is just the tip of the iceberg. Honda doesn't build something like this just for a concept. They're testing, refining, and laying the groundwork for a production-ready machine that could redefine what we expect from performance motorcycles. And here's where I want you involved. 
What are you hoping for out of this bike? Are you dreaming of a superbike rival to the Ducati Panigale and Yamaha R1, or something lighter and more agile, maybe in the vein of the CB650R but with way more punch? Drop your vision in the comments, because I read every single one and your ideas genuinely shape how we cover these developments. Now, as HSR Motors, here's my take. This isn't just about one engine or one bike. It's about Honda signaling that they're ready to innovate in the performance space again. Over the last decade, We've seen them focus heavily on reliability and mainstream appeal, but this feels like a return to their daring side, the side that gave us legends like the RC30 and the Fireblade in its wildest years. If this supercharged V3 makes it into a production bike, I think it could be one of the most exciting Honda motorcycles in decades. So before we wrap this up, let me circle back to the question I asked at the start. That sweet whine you hear in the last 12 seconds of the teaser? That's the intake sound of Honda's electric supercharger. Not background noise. Not a gimmick. A real, functional part of their new V3 engine. Here's a fun fact before we sign off. Did you know that the very first production motorcycle with a supercharger was the 1939 BMW Type 255 Compressor? It dominated racing before World War II, and technology like that is only now starting to evolve into the electric-assisted versions we're seeing today. It's proof that innovation comes in waves, sometimes decades apart. All right, let's bring it home. If you enjoyed this deep dive into Honda's electrifying new engine, help us reach our goal, 10,000 likes and 1,000 comments in the next 24 hours. Share this video with your riding buddies, drop your thoughts down below, and hit that subscribe button with the bell icon so you never miss these first look moments. If you want to go the extra mile and keep HSR motors rolling strong, you can even hit that super thanks button. But most importantly, keep the conversation going. What's your dream scenario for this engine? Let's hear it.